Okay, OpenAI just broke the internet with GPT-40. So what can it do? When can we use it? And what are the little details we might have missed? So let's get into it. This is their announcement. Hey, how's it going? Hey there, it's going great. How about you? I see you're rocking an OpenAI hoodie. Nice choice. What's up with that ceiling though? Are you in a cool industry style office or something? It's like FaceTiming a family member. Me? <laughs> the announcement is about me? Well, color me intrigued. It laughs and it's flattered? Are you kidding me? There's so much emotion in the voice. It's like very, very human. That's scary, but it's cool. It's so cool. But watch this. You got it. I was hoping that you could sing me the birthday song. Of course. <laughs> Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, Jordan, happy birthday to Jordan. Blah, 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 blah. It sings and it has an ad lib at the end of the happy birthday song. Well, hello, Bowser. Aren't you just the most adorable little thing? It meets your dog. This is insane. Sarcasm. Uh, I'd like you to be super sarcastic. Everything you say from now on is just going to be dripping in sarcasm. How does that sound? Oh, that sounds just amazing. Being sarcastic all the time isn't exhausting or anything. I'm so excited for this. <laughs> it has an attitude when you ask for one. I can't wait to use this. So there's, there's more. There's a lot more, but the voice and video features are the two that like just blow me away. It can also do like 3D design, better image generation. Let's go over a couple of things that you might have missed. Number one is this really cool blog post by Sam Altman, the CEO, where he's just, you know, very proud of this, but like, just to convey the impact, this piece here, the new voice and video mode is the best computer interface I've ever used. Feels like AI from the movies, still surprising to me that it's real. Human level response times and expressiveness turns out to be a big change. Then he goes on to talk about what's coming in the future, a lot of personalization, you're gonna basically, this is turning into Jarvis from Iron Man, and it's awesome. It's an incredibly exciting time to be alive. Another thing you might have missed, do you know what the O stands for? Take a guess. It is Omni. I feel like a game show host. So when can I use the, the voice and the, the video features? I checked my phone, it's not on there. And in the announcement, they not only admit that there are limitations, but they like show them off and it's awesome. So let's root, root, root for the home. Oh no, <laughs> what was that? So it's obviously not ready yet. And it's cool that they're even like sharing this with the world, but Text and image capabilities rolling out today. GPT-4.0 available in the free tier and to plus users with up to five times higher message limits. We will roll out a new version of voice mode with GPT-4.0 in alpha within chat GPT plus in the coming weeks. Developers can access it as a text and vision model. I might have to build an app with this. Oh, and by the way, I make videos about building apps and the apps that I build and we have a good time on my channel. So subscribe if you'd like and yeah. This is crazy. Thank you for watching.